Enough about her mom. Oh man, this guy right here. Here we go. Yes! Because I'm a no novice noob. So are you ready to see the great advent of... Dude? I lost my face! Watch as dude shows you how it's done. Dude, use the Pokeball. Seriously, this guy's nightmarish. He One, has no face. Two, three, cut! He's gonna absorb its face. <laughs> use the Rattata. Well done, my friend. Wow. Rattata. Stop shaking that ass at me, you brutal shit. Destroy it, level two. How disgusting. But yeah, this adventure will be somewhat different. Level scaling isn't quite as extreme as it was in uh, Gen 1. Yeah, it's a lot more toned down. I mean, that's for reasons we'll explain later, but... The path to the Elite Four this time isn't quite as steep. There's a lot more room for er error. A lot more room indeed. And we're just gonna go right back to Cherry Grove. Just say hi! Oh no, no ledge. My weaknesses. Yes, Rattata. Alright, now that you've done all of the things that I require you, you're no longer impeded by random trainer battles and trees can get in your way, and now can go onward. Hoot hoot. Who is this now? Sure, I guess so. Friend, whatever you say. Have fun battling. And then some guy freaking kicks you in the stomach after he, after he loses. Silver's a nice guy. No, not really. I was hoping that would hit, but now it's not. So, uh, hey, you wanna fight? Now you see here. Play on the weak. Now you see here, Bren. Uh, so this is the legend, Cal. Here he is. The beginning the of original. the birth of youngster Joey. The original and the best. As you can see, youngster Joey likes Brathstar. And it has nearly reached its final form. It's an honor, youngster Joey. So, uh, after you beat trainers up, some of them will, if you talk to them, some will ask for your phone number. Uh-huh. And I want your phone number, my friend. Oh no, Joey. Yes, You've Joey. You've made a terrible mistake. Are you say, excuse me? Most trainers will thun you, thun you up on random occurrences, just like, hey, that makes small talk with you. Some will want to battle again, and some will actually give you stuff. 
Uh huh. There's a list of what, uh, what trainers can get what on uh, some sites like OP and stuff like that. And there's like one of the few only ways you can get elemental stones, for example, through certain trainers. Need me stop missing the little shit. Huh. Rusty path we can battle other young trainers. Heart Cold and Soul Silver, you can find interesting Pokemon such as Whisper and Bidoof. Interesting Pokemon such as Whisper and B. Alright! Cal said that, not me. Oh shit, Youngster Joey's Japanese name is Goro. <laughs> 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 not pictured him picking up the player character and beating them in the head with his suddenly two arms. Oh shit, heresy. In rematches, this Rattata evolves. Oh no! Into a Raticate of level 21, 30, then 37. No see other people's Pokemon. Pokeballs would be thrown only at Wild Pokemon. That'll be a thief trick. Wow. Yeah, you don't get a choice in that matter. You see one, you have to fight it. Hmm. You know, it would be interesting if just, you could just choose not to fight a dude, you lock, you lock eyes with him. That'd be something like you see in Gen 7 or something. You run through, you're like, no, I don't want to fight. <laughs> like, oh, okay. Literally sad face. Sad music plays in the background, and you're refusing a trainer fight. Shit, I am hungry. I'm gonna need something to eat after this. Yeah, I know that feeling. Okay, he's just like. So. Don Juan, you just lost. Destroyed? Man, I probably should have bought some more. Uh, just saying, you know? Just, just saying, just, just saying. So yeah, 31 now. Are you serious? I am! No, no, sorry, I've just found out what the strongest wild Pokemon in this game is. Well, Later. Revere. Later. Revere, Cal. I caught the polywag. Not yet. That, that'll that be fun. Still! Tadpole. The stolen on its belly is inside showing through its skin. It looks clearer after it eats. Neat. Alright, female polywag, what do you, Cal? Hmm, female polywag, that's a tough one. Um... Aqua's good. But it doesn't really fit if we're going for Polyrath or Politoed, does it? No, not really. Wait a minute, hold on. Hmm. I think I got this. Whoa, excuse me. I can tell you that I really do need some food. Verbal heck a lot. No, we can't fit that one. <laughs> what the fuck did you just say? Fuck it, we'll go with Aqua. Let's go. Aqua fist! There we go. Uh, there we go. Let's do it. 
Exclamation mark. He has wallet to be. So yeah, there's ah, so fist. Yeah. So I, I would have said um I would have said Polytoad, but I think Polyrath is good. Yeah, let's go. Let's try for Polyrath. Polyrath it is. Right, so we've got two members of our team so far. Dark Cave. Oh boy, that sounds great, doesn't it? I'd explore it. So yeah, true to form, Dang Cave is very dark. You uh, can't do much here aside from fighting Zubat, a Geodude, and maybe, maybe you might be lucky to fight the true legend, Dunsparce. Our lord. <gasps> Not today, Zubat. I'm sorry. Let's see if I try to get that item. Damn kids, get off my lawn! So yeah, the first gym leader is a flying type. So if you wanted to uh, completely take him over, just get a Geo, dude. Uh, hold on a sec then. Uh, I guess I'm gonna have to go look up movesets, aren't I? While we're here. Uh, I don't believe Polyrath really learns any moves, does it? Um, come on. I think it learns one, yeah. Or one yeah, or two. but not, not, not a level up, I mean, but you buy my teams and stuff. Well, let's see what we got, Polyrath. Hmm. Mm. Neurobon. Well, its attack and special attack stats are okay-ish. By that I mean they're not that great at all. Still. Just keep spamming each life and bubble week for week shit. There we go. Okay, it learns mind reader level 51 and submission level 35. Do you understand? Yeah, um, I understand, I guess. Now let's see what Polyworld learns. Oh god. Easy, easy, well, easy, 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 easy. I'm guessing that's gonna be our surfer then. Oh, but Belly Drum at level 43 though. But that makes us miss submission. But there is a move relearner. And there are TMs as well. Uh Cal the move relearner is stadium two only. Ah, god damn it. In that case, surf it is. I'll have to miss out on Belly Drum. Sorry. I'm so sorry, Kel. It can obtain Earthquake, Ice Punch, and other interesting moves. Wait, there's a move tutor that teaches Ice Beam? Yeah, uh, Crystal introduced a move tutor. But that's not open right now. Nope. Not yet, it isn't. Also, we need to make sure we get something that can learn Metronome, okay? Yes, Cal. If I run into a Clefairy on my travels in uh, that place, sure, we'll catch one. Cause I don't know anything, I don't know anything else that learns Metronome naturally in this gen that I can catch in Johto. Thought those animations take way too long for how how weak the move is. So forgive me to speed up through it. Level six. Aqua Fist. Group level six. Completely fucked with the grammar as well. That's great. That's <laughs> great. See you in hell. For the move introduced in Generation One, see Metronome. Move. Metronome. 
Wag finger. Wag finger. Wag finger. Wag finger. Anyway, right, okay, what we got here? How can we obtain it in Generation 2? Metronome will not select itself or any of the following moves. Gen 1, struggle. Oh, Gen 2, there's a big list for what it won't pick. It will not do. Counter, Destiny Bond, Detect, Endure, Mimic, Miracle, Protect, Get, Sleep, Talk, Struggle, or Thief. Well, okay. The user waggles a finger and stimulates the brain into randomly using nearly any move. Hypnosis! Yeah, that's probably a keeper. Yeah, I'm gonna keep hypnosis. This is a status move, but it's sleep. Sleep is good. You're awesome, I like you. Oh, that's nice. I don't want your phone number though. You can, you, you, oh. you, you can give me berries, I don't want your phone number. Sorry, kid. Oh god, yeah, Togepi no, and Togepi and Togetic. <laughs> uh, that's a great joke, friend. Great joke. Wait a minute, there's no TM in this game for it. Yeah, there isn't. That's why I said me and Pokemon that learns it naturally. Poliwhirl and Poliwrath would be prime candidates. Balls. Dr. Wily from home. Uh, how hey do you feel friends, about- Hey friends, welcome to po Violet City. Continue, Cal. Cal will love this place considering it's purple. Oh yeah, it's a lovely place. Uh, how do you feel about Togetic? Oh shit, Clefable though. I love my boy Clefable, but how good are you in Gen 2? Let's find out. I'm gonna guess not very, but let's see. Uh, how early can you obtain Clefairy in Gen 2, actually? I'm pretty sure it's after the main portion. That's what I thought. Let me check. Damn, I love Metronome, but it's so hard to get compared to every other Gen. Gen 3? Fine. Gen 4? Go for it. Fire red, leaf green, and emerald, there are move tutors that will give you it. Like, what gives? Yep. I mean, TM-wise, it's only in, uh... Only in Gen 1. Which is dick. It is the final form of Cleffa. I nearly reached my final form. Curse you. Listen, no, I'm all things considered. Listen, I'm all things considered. Shitty on, unless I can evolve it. Huh. Talk about dis the disobedience and shit already. So, uh, we want to go here in Earl's, Earl's Pokemon Academy, like, first thing. Like, this is, like, something you must do. Please do it. Actually, no, before you go there, you want to, uh, talk to this guy right here. Battle Gym Leader? Wow. This is Earl! He's eccentric as hell. He kinda is. Uh, and also shows in the stadium too, voiced by Ted Lewis. Praise, praise be. Ted Lewis. <laughs> great, great joke, Ray. <laughs> I'm not wrong. <laughs> Ray. What? We can get Cleffa from the odd egg. This. This is the truth. And that would allow us to obtain our metronome. Glyphable isn't so bad in Gen 2 because, well, it's still early still early days. Its stats aren't perfect, but it's good enough. Its HP is great. That's probably our best bet. Oh wait, can we also get... Oh no, Togepi's the shitty egg, isn't it? Yes. 
Honestly, Togepi is trash. I mean, fucking Togekiss is my boy, though. Like, yeah. you don't fuck with Togekiss. If poison, the pull one instead loses HP. Poison lingers after the battle, and HP is lost after you walk. Secure it, Whoa. use an antidote. Process reduces speed and may prevent movement. It remains after battle, so use a paralysis heal. If well, sleep, your Pokemon Aww. can't make a move. A sleeping Aww. Pokemon doesn't wake up after battle. Wake it up with an awakening! A burn That's... suddenly consumes HP. It also reduces attack power. A burn lingers after battle. Use a burn heal as the cure. But I burn it. If your Pokemon is frozen, it can't do a thing. It remains frozen after battle. I thought, I thought it was a nice heal. Oh, goodness gracious me. Ray. What? Necrodeus will live again. That's what I called my, uh, oh. the Fable in Gen 6. Necrodeus. Literally, God of Death. Uh, so yeah. It's a fitting name for that, right? True. Uh, so yeah, actually, looking at Togetic, its stats aren't actually bad. But we could be bowling around with a shiny called Fable. Like... Like, come on. Uh, in case you're wondering, the, the odd egg is something we get uh, a little later on. Yeah, but still fairly early in the game that uh, it can be still usable. Yeah, and basically. Very, very much uh, in the team. Yeah, it has a high chance, 14% chance of being shiny in this version. Uh, it can be either a Pichu, a Cleffa, an Iglybuff, Tyrogue, Smoochum, Elekid, or Magby. Most of the possibilities are better than Cleffa, but. I do like the fable. I like the fable too. I personally, I was gonna go get like a Magby or an Elkin from the Eye Egg, but I also like the fable. So, like shiny, shiny fable with Metronome. I'd say that's pretty fun. Yeah, I'd say that's too tempting to pass up. So, yeah, I know, I, I know what I gotta do, but uh, I gotta make sure. Who? I gotta make sure I uh, set up properly so I. So it comes out as the oh, thing we dude, want. it's purple because of the coloration. Like it becomes more pink in later versions where it's shiny. Hot oh, damn! Ah, uh, yeah, I can live with that. Of course, Calwood. Question is, Gen Two, what can it learn? Apart from well, Metronome. Uh, Moonlight, which is good for restoring HP, I guess. Yeah, Sing. Man. Double slap. It can learn. Toxic, Zap Cannon. Fucking Hyper loves, Beep. Fucking love Zap Cannon. Oh, that look male. Oh. It can learn fucking Solar Beam. Psychic would be good for it. It can also load Shadow Ball. Ice Punch. Fire Blast. Thunder Punch. Dream Eater, which would sync with Sing very well, I guess. Actually, that's not a bad idea. And Nightmare. Buffy with a true Necrodeus. Holy shit, if we give it Nightmare and Dream Eater, along with Sing... Holy shit, it really is the Necro Days! <laughs> Wait, that would be a perfect one, wouldn't it, actually? Metronome, Sing, Dream Eater, Nightmare! Holy balls. The where ultimate do you get, power! Where do you get these TMs out of curiosity? Uh, Route 31 after after delivering... Oh, Randy Spiro. Ugh. Uh. You remember that, don't you? I do. I'm gonna do it. Don't worry. Fucking Kenya. Uh, anyway. So, uh, there's a- there's a- there's a, something in the way. Um, you can't pass through it. Stupid trick. Anyway. There are wild Pokemon here, but they took out the best Pokemon in this section. I miss Mareep already!
But in the comments you can find the Growlithe here. Arcanine is pretty baller. Oh, I have some mm -hmm. Alright, so we can fight the gym right now, or we can do something else before fighting the gym. And we're gonna do that and then call this a recording sesh. Indeed. So they made a big deal about this place, the Sprout Tower. Experience the way of Pokemon. So, um, guess what? Guess what Pokemon is not being used in this place? Sorry, I'm <laughs> I'm sorry, too. Damn, check out that spur rotation. That's some sick shit. Yeah, the, the main challenge here is that you go all the way to the top, and then you reach the stage at the top, and he's like, Hey, you're good. Here, have this 3HM. But in the interim, you gotta fight other sages. Where's Gets is at? He's like, Nico! Nico! <laughs> Nico! <What> does it? <laughs> Fuck. So all the sages here have sprout. Yeah. <laughs> this is why I'm not using Aqua Fist, because all, they all know Vine Whip and they'll say goodbye. I'll see you in the next dimension. I'm so she sorry. She won't last very long. Also, just realized, with no TMs, we're gonna have to do the exact thing for each sa sa same gem. <laughs> oh god. Also, that Clefable's gonna be fucking horrific, do you realize this? I do, it's gonna be great. Nightmare's a really strong move. Uh, Dream Eater's also very powerful. Uh, Viridian City's where you get Dream Eater TM. Oh. That's not so far, is it? What will we put in its place in the interim? Ah, oh, we'll figure that out. Probably like an one or something. Yeah, all in good time. Nightmare's fairly early on, but... Ah, uh, yeah, Clefable's special attack is quite good still. It's like 85, isn't it? Yeah. This attack isn't horrific. 70s... It's meh, but it's not so much that physical moves are complete trash. It's not fucking chancy. We'll say that much, eh? Yeah, it's not chancy. Oh god, it's not chancy. So yeah, you can fight what Pokemon here. Uh, usually they're at attack. Uh, unless you come here at night. Then, um, something else happens. Something else happens. You're not gonna show up. So I, hear the, I, hear, I hear the sages show up, and then I hope the, the theme pops up, and all I hear from the theme is like, freaking, uh... I hear freaking Korean Village from Phoenix Wright. Like, no. Not, no, don't make me go back there. I guess it's a relation hazard for a temple from the third game, but hey, I guess it's probably a little more than really draw, draw me out than Korean Village. But hey, I'm rambling. What do you want me to do? I'm meeting up freaking Bells for out They're all level 3. Some are level yes. 5, some are level 7. Ooh, Sprout, Sprout Tower isn't the most exciting of places, is it? Like, come on. Level with me. a shame. In Gen 5, Metronome won't copy V-Create. <laughs> it's just like, I am God. Oh, poor V-Create. Wait, so it doesn't do V-Create, but it's got every every possibility of using something like fucking, I don't know, Spatial Rend. 
That's not in the that's not in the list. Technoblast and V Create are, but Freaking Technoblast! But most legendary moves are kinda there. So yeah, as you saw as Kyle was talking over, you can counter Ghastly Gear at night. Mm -hmm. And That's normally right. it'd be all about that fucking Gengar, but ah, it's a trade Pokemon, so I can't do that. Yeah, I kinda shit out of luck here. Uh, don't worry, I'll have another use for a Ghastly when the time is right, but uh, not now. Find that level 12, which means I can get Ember. Can you guy? Can you say 420 Blaze it? No. But anyway, yes, I can. Level 12 already, Jesus. Well, this LP is over. See it. So tell me, Ray. If we can't get Gengar. Actually, that locks us out of some other cool Pokemon, doesn't it? I'm sorry, Caesar. It was not meant to be. Caesar, especially Caesar. That one's, that one's like a dagger through my heart. I love Caesar, and we'd totally be using him. I'm so sorry. We could probably cheat and just be like, nah, fuck it, I'll start sending me Caesar. That would be cool. I mean, given we've shattered this game and shattered the other game into 100 pieces and got new. I mean, I'm not above it, personally. No, me neither. If you said the word, then it would be done. Hell, if you could find a way to get a fucking Politoed, I would. Love Politoed. So much. One of my personal favourites, but still. Uh. Sounding names when this this guy shows up and freaking Nico earlier. Nico. Yes, I get it. You're a sage. You have really bald heads. Balding. You're balding your map sprite, but in battle you're balding. Holy shit. Troy. Baker? Maybe. Ah, uh, so Crystal has its own definition for Polyrath, unlike gold, where it's like, this strong and swim it's good swimmer is even capable of crossing the Pacific Ocean just by kicking. The Pacific Ocean. 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 Pacific now where might that be? They're even using that one in fucking X. God damn it, guys. Where is this Pacific Ocean? Same place in China, I bet. And... Guyana. And Guyana. So, uh, you make it all the way to the top and you see that, um, Silver is having a go. Or he had a go. With the Elder. Hulk won our tools of war. <laughs> Um, 
saying that you lost to me. Still, we're using escape rope. This place sure was interesting, old Matt. Yeah, uh, so, uh, hey, uh, how's it going? Yeah, that seems to be the motif here. Oh, didn't you just get your ass beat? Yeah, for real, unless you have, like, a, a set of Max Relives on hand. Sage Leap. Leap, please. Unsurprisingly, he has... Bellsprout. More Bellsprout! Level 14! Also, this is another generic trainer in this game, but this guy shows up in the thing that didn't happen in Gen 1. Trainers with variable levels! Wow! Like, I'm sure you've noticed that in Gen 1, all the regular trainers had Pokemon. When they all had Pokemon more than one, they were always the same level. But here is the first game where they had variable levels. Bell Sprout. But yeah, you can tell the amount of effort they put into this game. I mean, given given this came off the heels of Pokemania, and it wasn't slowing down anytime soon. Indeed. So, uh, guess what, Cal? So, uh, are we sure this that uh, Syndical is normal mode? Yeah, the whole level 14 thing. I did forget about that. Are you ready? Holy shit! Quilava. Lava, please. Meanwhile, Poliwag be like, Poliwag. Oh, oh no. Agent 5, Flash! You get, you get that shit out of here, old man. That thing is as outdated as you are. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Flash. Stop this. Thanks for that, old man. Peace out. And so we've returned. So a fun little diversion. Fun indeed. Alright, so uh... Off the clock I'm gonna grind up Aqua Fist to respectable levels so he's not a little shit anymore. And then yeah. we're gonna go beat up Falcon next time. Sounds like a plan. So yeah, uh, that's that for now. So uh, we'll see you guys next time on Super Mario Crystal. Peace. See ya.